say, honey, the guests are getting a little worried because it's getting dark out and they're wondering if we should head in for the night. Nah, we can stay out as long as we want. Remember that new Navigator 2, the thermal imager we had installed? Oh, the high-tech camera you were telling me about. Mm-hmm. Let me show you how it works. Take a look. It sees in total darkness, better at night than I can during the day, because it sees heat, not light. That's really cool. So it turns night into day. That's right. That's great. Well, since we don't have to go in, I'm going to tell our guests they have nothing to worry about. Great. I'll be in in a few. Sundown used to be my cue for pulling up anchor and heading in for the night. I just didn't feel comfortable placing my family and friends in danger, or my boat, while I tried to navigate in the dark. Sure, my GPS plotter could take me from point A to point B, but I still couldn't see where I was going. And radar is great during the day when I can see what it returns, but I just don't feel comfortable relying on it at night, when I can't tell if it's giving me an accurate picture of what's out there or what's floating in the water. But the Navigator 2 is something else altogether. The Navigator 2 is a thermal imaging camera. It makes video pictures from heat, not light. So not only can I still see when the sun goes down, but I can often see other vessels farther away at night with the Navigator 2 than I can with my own eyes during the day. Regular video cameras make pictures out of visible light, just like our eyes. But thermal imagers sense subtle differences in temperature called heat signatures. Everything around us has a heat signature, even ice. Warmer objects appear white and cooler objects appear black. Thermal imagers aren't the same as the night vision cameras you see on TV. Night vision devices need some light to work. If they don't get enough light, they don't let you see a thing. If there's too much light, they get saturated and wash out. Thermal imagers work regardless of lighting conditions. The Navigator 2 uses the same thermal imaging technology the military has used for seeing at night since the 1960s. As the world leader in thermal imaging technology, FLIR systems put their decades of experience to work in developing the Navigator 2 thermal imager. The result? A revolutionary nighttime imager with the same technology BMW sells as their night vision camera. The Navigator 2 significantly reduces the dangers of nighttime boating. It lets you see more of your surroundings. It works in total darkness through smoke and haze. The Navigator 2 is sensitive enough to let you see hazards in plenty of time to steer around them. Whether in black and white or with optional color palettes, you can clearly see outcroppings of land, bridge supports, channel markers, and debris floating in the water. When I return to the marina late at night, I can clearly see entrances, buoys, and other details I struggled to make out before. It gives me the confidence to leave early or return late and navigate safely. That means a lot to me and to my family and friends. The Navigator 2 has quickly become the most useful piece of electronic gear in my boat. The joystick control unit, or JCU, gives you immediate access to all of the camera's functions. The home button points the Navigator 2 at a programmable position relative to the bow of your vessel, usually straight ahead. Press the zoom button to activate the 2XE zoom for when you want to get a good look at something far away. The scene button lets you choose from one of four available preset gain and level settings the night running, day running, man overboard, and night docking settings are each optimized for different conditions. The polarity button lets you choose between the Navigator 2's five available color palettes, white hot, black hot, red hot, rainbow, and fusion. Select the one you like the best for the conditions you're in. With the joystick, I can effortlessly point the camera in any direction. No matter what I'm doing, whether I'm navigating a crowded shipping channel or using the powerful thermal camera to stay safe while riding at anchor, this joystick is intuitive and easy to use. What's more, 
With Navigator 2's unique AccuPoint control and positioning feature, you'll always know where you're looking and where the camera is pointing. And we can watch the images on the flybridge or from a second control station down below. At night, we can use the Navigator 2 to investigate noises or suspicious activities on shore. And if someone fell overboard, I could use my Navigator 2 to help find them. After all, this is the same FLIR technology that the Coast Guard and hundreds of police agencies and military forces around the world use for that very purpose. And the Navigator 2 is so easy to install. It uses a standard video cable and plugs into any multifunction display with an auxiliary video input. The Navigator 2 is so easy to use. It's fully automatic. You just turn it on and navigate with a confidence you've never felt before. While I don't rely only on my Navigator 2 to get me where I'm going, it lets me see potential hazards earlier than ever before, letting me make necessary course corrections to keep my guests and my boat safe. So, everybody having a good time? They sure are, and they're thrilled we don't have to head into shore yet. Yeah, thanks to the Navigator too. Shall we join our guests? Oh, you bet. Find out for yourself. Everyone who has seen this technology agrees that it's vital equipment for the serious boater. FLIR Systems, the world leader in thermal imaging technology, manufactures practical solutions that have redefined the cost of thermal imaging ownership. Never before has this much performance been offered at such a low cost.